if we rank things in terms of priorities, okay, I would rank at the absolute top of the list in terms of things that we are going to focus in on. Number one is always going to be target and alignment. Okay, number one is target and alignment. So let's make sure that, again, we know that your tendency is probably to aim a little bit right. So let's ensure that before every shot, we, we start the routine from back here. You can hold the golf club up if you want to, just to give yourself a reference in terms of where you're gonna set yourself up. But start every golf shot, okay, once you've selected your golf club, Start every golf shot with your routine behind the golf ball. I want you to be able to see your target line. And then when you walk up to the shot, just making sure that we're aiming parallel to that target line. Again, we're not trying to point ourselves at the target. We're trying to point the club face to the target and then have our body parallel to the aim of the club face. Okay, so it will inevitably feel a little bit left. Okay, that is very normal. So. Number one in terms of our priority list is always going to be your alignment to target. Number two on your priority list is going to be brushing the ground, okay? It seems like a very simple task, but often overlooked. We need to be able to get this club to strike the ground if we're going to have a quality iron shot, okay? Let's leave driver just for a second and we'll just focus in on irons. We have to brush the ground to get that golf ball up in the air. We have to brush the ground in order to hit the true middle or sweet spot of that club face. So what we're looking for when it comes to a solid brush of the ground, if you take our stance and you think of where the middle of the stance would be, the brush where my golf club strikes the ground should always be slightly after the center of my stance. So I'm always looking to make contact with the ground just after the middle of the stance. So being able just to loosen yourself up, perhaps like in between shots, maybe while you're playing partners, hitting his shot, like making a couple of practice wings where you brush the ground helps us to get used to what we are going to eventually need in the swing. Okay, we just need that little brush. We need to take some divot. Okay, we don't want the club digging, but we have to hit the ground a little bit. Okay, so brushing the ground, I'd rank that second on your priority list. Ranking third on your priority list is going to be something